Okay, so the Rhinos PDRL coming back to Headingley on the 23rd of June. Uh, you guys have both signed up to be part of this uh, great concept. So what got you involved in this game? Well, I've got to be honest, I admire the lads that play and I, you know, we've always said on our radio show that how great it must be to represent your club and those guys are lucky enough to represent Leeds. I've been lucky enough to be asked to play. I'll tell you what, it's an honour to take the field with some of those guys. We've, we've met a lot of them and, and they are genuine heroes. The, the things they've overcome to play, it'd be a pleasure for me to get on the pitch with them uh, and I'm I genuinely am looking forward to it, it's going to be a great day. Yeah, to see, as, Mar as Mark has mentioned, you know, the, the, these guys are proper heroes, aren't they? And uh, we'll even show what, what they want to do. They want to be, as, as we know with the discipline, what they've got, they still want to play this great game of Rupert League and they want to be part of this magnificent stadium. And when I when I, was, when I was got told about it that Mark Wilson had signed up and that he was playing for Leeds, the, the Leeds club who he rips into every Monday night and it, I'm absolutely delighted that he's got the show on here. And I must say, I confessed I wanted to play for Warrington because I wanted to rip into him. But anyway, it's now here. I haven't put the Leeds shirt on since I left here in 96. And I tell you what, I can't wait to be on the field with them heroes come the 23rd of this month. And uh, a self-confessed Bradford fan, <coughs> it's going to be a bit odd for you to put a Rhino shirt on, but it's bigger than that. It's all about getting involved this new concept which is you know, great for so many people who thought they'd never play rugby again. Oh, exactly right, it's going to be an honour, it's going to be, I mean he's done, it, he's done it hundreds of times, I've never had that, that privilege and it, it, look, it'll be a special moment. My biggest worry is, I've not played rugby for 24 years, that's going to be a problem straight away, we'll get the excuse in early, uh, but it's not letting the guys down because today these guys, this is not messing around, this is proper rugby league yeah. and I'm going to have to pull my weight if I, uh, you know, if I want to be included again, so I genuinely am looking forward to it. And um, obviously this game is part of uh, you know, a whole day of fundraising for the concept, so all yeah. the donations on the gate are going to go back towards it, so what's your message to people who maybe never seen a game before, want to come down and, and get involved? Oh, did you, did you? Just get down and support these guys, you know, because and, and I say the uh, you know they can't do everything what what they, what they want to be doing in everyday life. So, but this is the enjoyment what they get. Also, too, it might be a bit of frustration what they want to get out as well from there. But it's going to be enjoyment. You'll see a smile on everybody's faces. Come down and support and really see some proper heroes on this great rubber league pitch. Yeah, get along, come and support the guys wearing the lead shirt and also the Warren boys as well. I think the people will be surprised when they come down. They'll be surprised at the ferocity of this game. This is proper rugby league. This is not messing about. That's what's worrying me. I'll tell you what, mate. Have you ever scored a hat trick for anybody? Because one be for sure. I'm led to believe you've still got a bit of pace. Get yourself outside the Who legend. I'll, you I'll put you Richard Shaw right and Phil Kaplan are telling me you've looked pretty good on the uh, on the treadmill. So we'll be for sure. Stand outside the legend and I'll put you through for a hat trick on the, 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 the lovely turf here at Eddingley. I'll see you on the 23rd. <laughs>